Hello there. I am excited to guide you through this initiation trip. This meditation will help you put the old behind, welcome change, and therefore elevate your vibratory field and bring you guidance toward well-being. So, lie down comfortably and close your eyes. You are comfortable. Bring your attention to the way you are breathing. Feel the air going in and out of your nostrils. Feel the crisp air getting into your nose with each inhale, traveling all the way to your lungs. The air gets warmer and exits hand in hand with all of the used up energy each time you exhale. Count your breath now. Make sure to slow down its pace with each breath you take. Start from the number 88. 88, inhale. 88, exhale. And then 87, inhale. 87, exhale, 86, inhale, and so on, focus on the count. If you lose your train of thought, start over at 88, without judgment.
Your entire body is relaxed now. It releases all of the tension little by little. Allow the relaxation to settle in even more. Give in. You are letting go completely. Think of an animal now, the first animal which comes to mind. This animal will be your spirit animal. It will stay by your side and protect you all throughout this adventure within subconsciousness. You are ready. Your protective spirit animal is by your side. A giant and magnificent tree appears before you. Picture it. Draw it in your mind. This tree is the symbol of the shamanic vision. This tree paints a picture. Its trunk depicts the alternate world. Its roots, digging deeply into the soil, portrays the world below. And its branches, reaching out high in the sky, represent the world above. The tree is inviting you to a unique and life-changing experience. Picture a door and draw it onto the wide trunk of the tree. Open that door and walk into the tree trunk. Your spirit animal is by your side, protecting you. You may now make your way down to the world below. Your spirit animal leads the way. It seems like it is gliding down the slide, taking it to the roots of the tree, very deep down. So you follow it. You glide down. Make your way down, down. You are letting this fall happen. Then you arrive in the underworld. An elder shaman greets you. She explains that you are about to experience death, to then experience rebirth. She is there, so is your spirit animal. They will both be by your side throughout this experience. She hands you a beverage which will allow you to experience what death feels like and to lie down onto the ground. Are you scared? How are you feeling? Will you drink the shaman's beverage? 
If you do not feel like doing this experience after all, you may walk out of this meditation slowly. What is it going to be? Are you ready to experience death to be born again? Changed? Not the same? The shaman and your spirit animal offer you to drink this tasty liquid and go through the experience. They are here. They are coming with you. You drink up and you lie down. You enter a kind of trance during which you are aware of what you need to leave behind, to move on from, in order to finish this cycle you are in and start a new one. What do you need to let go of, to quit, to release? What do you need to give up on at this moment in time? Picture yourself letting go completely of what you need to give up on. Death is a process of renouncement during which we abandon everything we own or think we own and everything we are or think we are. Allow this process to happen. You are now in a long tunnel. You are passing through. Your spirit animal is by your side. You are letting go of everything, leaving everything behind in that tunnel. You are unburdening yourself. An intense sense of quiet and peace settles within you. You are feeling good. Your body is going to feel numb now before switching into the utmost state of relaxation. Then into a state of drowsiness. You can sense that you do not need anything anymore and it feels nice. It feels just like a dream in which your brain activity picks up the pace. You feel as if you are transcending time and space. Now comes a feeling of unity with your surroundings and your loved ones. You see your life flashing before your eyes.
you feel more and more serene and relaxed. You know that you are departing on the trip whose destination remains unknown. And then it's gone. Your body is lifeless, but your mind is alive, still. And you witness something quite peculiar. The shaman walks up to your lifeless body, embraces it in her arms, and lulls it much like you would a baby, singing a shamanic prayer, which cleanses your memory and all of your negative karma. Watching her makes it look so easy. She carries you as if your body had lost all of its weight, light as a newborn. She casts an incantation for a long while. Your conscience overhears how pure it sounds and the incredibly high vibratory frequency of her beautiful voice. She then proceeds to put down your lifeless body by a blue water-filled pond. It is remarkable. Your conscience follows suit and keeps an eye on everything she does. She delicately plunges your body into that blue-colored water and beckons rituals of protection and cleanse for your entire body. She also washes your face and your hair in that blue water. Your conscience feels that each gesture is driven by an infinite amount of love and tenderness. You witness the scene with great interest and know that this cleaning process is key in order to go on to the other side and start a new cycle. She then lies you down onto a white sheet on the ground and kindly dries your body. Once your body is dry, she starts dancing around you and casts incantations again. Your spirit animal is here, dancing with her it seems like. You are a witness to this ritual. And then, you sense life slowly coming back within you. Your conscience gets back in your body via the crown chakra, located at the top of your head. You are being born again. You have gone through the tunnel, the way through, and you are alive. Open your eyes. The shaman laughs as she watches you. Your spirit animal confesses that you are now ready to explore the world above, as you have been initiated to death and rebirth 
and the vibratory levels of your conscience are now at an all-time high. You have been introduced to transcendence. You may leave the shaman now. You feel both different and the same as you did before. Follow your animal. Place yourself at the entrance of one of the tree's roots. And just like that, you are sucked in, lifted, and taken upwards. You go up, up letting the elevation process happen. You are going through the roots, then the tree trunk, and then you aim upwards for the branches, higher and higher. You end up going past the branches, up, higher and higher, until you reach the world above at last. Let it all happen. Your spirit animal is by your side. Explore the world above. Welcome it and get to know that world. Experience it to the fullest.
Someone is calling your name out there. Your spirit animal is calling out your name. It is time to get back, to go back down. You are going back down, slowly and gently. You find yourself back at that door on the inside of that trunk. You walk out of the tree. You feel a new, different, casting a brand new eye on life and the world. Make sure to thank your spirit animal. It may have something to tell you. You may leave your protective friend and get back in your physical body, lying down, relaxed, safe and sound. Be aware of where you are. Be aware of your arms, your hands, your legs, your feet, of your entire body. Look back on what you just experienced and take your time. You are slowly coming back. There is no rush. Listen to yourself and do not rush it. Whenever the time feels right, you may start moving again, stretching, all the while making sure to take all of the time you need. Come back at your own pace. There is no rush. Get back to your daily activities only when you want to. See you very soon for another inner journey. Take good care of yourselves.